In this video, we're going to talk about whether you can do a 1031 exchange all by yourself and save taxes. Well, sorry to tell you, you can't do that. The reason is you do need to have a third party holding your money. And that third party is called a qualified intermediary or an accommodator. Now, can you use your attorney as an accommodator? Maybe. Make sure they have a pretty good insurance policy because they're going to be holding a lot of money and you want them well bonded. Or how about your brother-in-law? Maybe that would be a good idea because he's a pretty good guy. However, no relatives are allowed. Has to be a completely unique person or entity holding your funds. And can you do it without escrow or closing? Perhaps you could do it with your attorney. You possibly, if you're a real estate broker, could close it yourself. But the big key is here, you must have a neutral third party holding your funds that go from one property to the other. And so no, if you want to call it really yourself, I'd say absolutely not. Better talk to your attorney before you even consider it because it would be a shame to work so hard, sell your property, get another property and not have it tax deferred. And check out this next video so that you can learn more about how to save money on your taxes using a 1031 exchange. And if we haven't yet met, I'm Maxine Golden, your 1031 exchange lady. I'll see you in the next video.